Hey, I hope you're doing well today. Thank you so much for uh, stopping by my channel and checking out this video. Today, we are gonna be looking at the new 77 Outdoor Powerful 1000 Lumen S15 Pro USB-C Rechargeable Pocket Flashlight. When you receive it, it will have this band around it and it says basically to take out the insulation paper from inside. So all you do is throw that to the side so it unscrews from the middle body, not the end. And make sure to take this insulation paper out or your flashlight will not work because it's not making contact with the battery. Let's toss that over there. And then, oh, it's a Sofern battery. And I don't know if 77 Outdoor is possibly maybe a sister company of Sofern, but it does come with a Sofern rechargeable battery. And I know when you go on Amazon, the store is called 77 Outdoor and they actually feature a lot of items from Sofern. So that does make sense. So yeah, this uses a 18650 uh, lithium ion battery, 3.7 volt. And this one is a 3000 milliamp hour battery. And it looks like the construction overall is, uh, it's somewhat basic, but yeah, it does have knurling at the end here for grip. And it doesn't look like it has a deep carry pocket clip, but it, it's, a, it's a decent clip. Yeah, that's decent metal. So it's not gonna bend. Uh, it looks like it was machined well. There's no uh, rough edges or burrs around anything. It looks like it was maybe lightly pre-oiled from the factory. I'm gonna zoom in here. So yeah, in here is a powerful SST40. So yeah, that is what is pumping out those 1000 lumens out of this little flashlight. And then actually going to the back here, if you lift up the silicone gasket there, you'll have a USB-C port for charging right there. Yeah, and I like these gaskets too because they have little pull tabs so you just take your nails and kind of pull it back. And I like that the gasket doesn't really rise up. It doesn't protrude out. Um, it's actually seated in there pretty nicely. And it does have some fins here for cooling, so I think that'll help. And also at the uh, opposite end, it does have this knurling, so that way it helps with grip. Uh, the paint on it, it's not really, a, it's like a matte gloss, I would call it. So it does have a matte finish to it but with a bit of a gloss to it. So it still is slightly shiny. And then inside here is a small spring. Uh, has a small squish to it, but uh, overall it looks real nice. And then down in the bottom, yeah, that one actually is a, a little bit more firm. So, and this is really lightweight at only 2.2 ounces and it's only 4.5 inches in length. So this little flashlight can be carried easily by anyone. And on the front glass, it's high strength tempered glass, and it is IP65 water resistant. So it does have a lockout mode on it. If you tap the button four times, it will lock it out and it blinks twice to let you know, hey, it's locked out. Then when you go to press it, if you press it, it will blink twice to let you know it's locked out. And then to get out of the lockout mode, one, two, three, four, again, What's cool is it has a nice green illuminated light here and lets you know that, hey, your battery is good. It's green, it's ready to go. So the information that I found is if you hold down the button, it gives you a moonlight mode, which as you can see is very, very low. I believe it's five lumens for moonlight mode. And if we press the button once, this brings us to low. This light I can already tell is gonna be a pretty nice thrower. Um, honestly, there's a little light spill on the outside, but that SST40, it's, uh, it's a nice thrower. So yeah, we're gonna have a nice beam. Uh, low is 30 lumens, and then if you hold it down, it goes up to medium at 300 lumens, and holding it down one more time brings you to high, and that is 1,000 lumens. And again, you can see that nice beam pattern. You can see a little bit of light spillage over here, and actually on this light, high and turbo are both 1000 lumens. If you're in low and you double tap, that brings you right to high, which again is basically turbo, it's 1000 lumens. And if you're in medium, again, if you double tap, it's gonna take you right back to high, which is also the same as turbo. So yeah, and 1000 lumens is definitely a nice light. Uh, it's great for pretty much any task that you would need it for. If you triple click, it's actually gonna take you to the strobe. So strobe warning. So that is the fast tactical strobe. And to get out of it, just tap one more time. And that will work in any mode. So whether it's high, medium, or low, or if it's off, one, two, three, 
it's gonna take you right back to the strobe. All right, getting the lights back turned on. And one of the things that I really love about this light is it's magnetic. So if you need to put it on your car or a metal pole or something else, guess what? It's gonna stick and uh, yeah. So a great light in a nice little package, 1000 lumens, USB-C charging, IP65 waterproof, uh, easy one touch button and a magnet. And then to top it off, you have that SST40 in there. It also has a impact resistance of 1.5 meters. So as far as falls go. So if you're looking for an easy UI, uh, easy user interface, this is definitely a great bang for your buck. Um, right now on Amazon, as of May 21st, 2024, this light is $19.99 US and it does have a 20% off coupon. But yeah, just seeing this in my home, I would say the 77 outdoor claim of 1000 lumens is pretty close, uh, if not spot on. It definitely is uh, very bright. So one other thing I just recently started on videos is actually taking the flashlight and seeing if it will start a box on fire. Uh, the reason being a lot of people use these for survival and preparedness and I think a lot of people want to know, hey, if I'm carrying this and this is all I have and I'm lost, is this going to start a fire? All right, so I've gone ahead and I've zoomed in. Uh, let's go ahead and double click and see if this is going to make it smoke or if it's going to catch fire. Wow, I think you guys should be able to see that. I can see some smoke, just a little bit of smoke. Ooh, it's getting warm. Yeah, so there is a little bit of smoke coming off of it. So yeah, this, I think for sure if you had some flammable material of some type, le you know, dried leaves, yeah, this absolutely would start a fire. So I want to say again to 77 Outdoor Store, thank you so much for sending me this uh, really cool light out uh, for testing and reviewing. I will have some beam shots coming up uh, within the next few days or so. Uh, weather has been terrible. We have had so much rain and wind. It's kind of ridiculous. I'm hoping by this weekend, I will have some more videos coming up soon. Yeah, and if you like what you saw, please leave a thumbs up and or subscribe uh, below if you're not already subscribed. I appreciate the time that you took to check out this review. And again, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you to 77 Outdoor. I will see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.